Guys, welcome back to the channel for episode 3 of Enfield of Dreams, playing as Enfield, of course, in our first season in the Vanarama National League South. And we've had a pretty decent start, I'd say. You would have seen us in the previous episode beat to Hampton and Ridgeman 2-1 in our opening league game of the season. We then went on to beat Dartford 3-2, where we did have a comfortable 2-0 lead, 3-0 lead, sorry, and then... Uh, Ade Aziz got two goals very late on, but we managed to hold on to the win. We then kept a clean sheet at home to Slough, where we won 2-0. We then dropped points away against Ebsfleet. We were 2-0 up, but then a late equaliser forced, um, forced us to just accept a point. We then had another draw, this time at home to Welling, where again we did take the lead, but again were pegged back. We had a very late winner at Braintree, where again we, were, we went 1-0 up, pegged back to... 1-1, one, one, then 2-1 two, up, made back to 2-2. Two, two. We then had Kingsley, Kingsley Murray score in the 91st minute to give us all three points. And again, we've just beat uh, Boas and Pitsy in the FA Cup second qualifying round. Where again, we were 3-0 up, cruising, then conceded two late goals. But thankfully, we held on. Now, in this video, we are going to just be playing Tombridge, Tombridge, Tombridge Angels. I knew that. I wanted to say Tombridge Wells for some reason. I really don't know why. Um, but there we go. Um, if we have a look at transfers. Now, a few players have come in. But also, we've had a few players leave. Uh, Murtak was actually approached by this team. Who play in uh, this the Northern Irish, Le Northern Irish League. Or the Irish League. I really get confused. Northern, I Northern Ireland. There you go. Northern Ireland. I knew that. No I was going to say Northern Ireland to begin with. Do apologise. Uh, but as you can, s you would have seen, we've had a few other goal scorers there. And uh, we've got a few um, loans in. So Tom Hewlett coming in from Burton, Burt White from Ipswich, Kingsley Murray from Bristol Rovers, and Ollie Tomlinson from Plymouth. No wage contribution, which works absolutely fine for me. We did sign our striker. Enoch Asante comes in. He's a pressing forward. And um, hopefully, I'm pretty sure I'm, we're playing him on that. He scored one goal in his opening three games. He did have, I think, one or two goals chalked off for offside as well in a game. It might have been the Ipswich game. Honestly, can't remember now. Uh, but we have actually released a couple of players as well. So um, we released uh, Saramento. You would have seen us sign him. Uh, Thorpe, another right winger, and Sam Keith, who um, we actually didn't actually have for that long. Now, um, oh, we actually bought him as well, didn't we? Ah, oh, what a waste of six grand. Ah. Oh. Silly, silly me. Let's get into this game then. I'm pretty sure we've got our full strength team out here. Daniel Wright is actually doing pretty well. He scored um, some cracking free kicks, has to be said. So uh, despite his um, low ability, he's actually doing really, really well. He's one of these other ones that would have prob would probably get released because of his appearance fee. 750. Are we over the wage budget? We are by probably about 750 so if he doesn't keep this up he's out the door so let's get into this game against Tombridge Tombridge are actually bottom at the moment we are top so you know exactly how this is going to go we're probably going to lose knowing our luck but we are going with Dickerson and goal a back four of McQueen Colin Smith and Corrigan A to B Wright and Onan in midfield with Fowl Carrington supporting Asante up front now I did have him uh, was it? I tell you what, we'll do it as a target forward. Never used one of these on this game. Obviously, it was a target man previously, but that I believe was just in a support role. Uh, but I guess we'll see. Uh, so yeah, like I said, we're only going to be playing the one game again in this episode. Not really sure on a schedule for this series yet. I like I said previously, I was going to do it Monday, Wednesday, Friday. I'm not even sure when I decided to release episode two. I'm thinking I would have probably stuck to Friday on that. I'm not sure. Oh, no. That's not a good start. Bruised ankle. He's not complaining now. Well, that's something we'll have to monitor. Wood now for Tombridge. Modest. Back to fielding. Goes to Miles. See, Tombridge are coming forward here. I was, I was afraid of this. Wood. Bear, Hill, Fielding, 
And to bear whips it in. And we've conceded a penalty. Oh no. That is just not what I wanted. This is just not a good start at all, is it? Turner with the penalty. Oh! So he hit the post and Dickerson saved it from the post. Wow. Okay. Wow. I can't say I see that very often. We're going to encourage because we should be doing better than this. A 0-0 at home to Tombridge is not what I want. They're going to get their first point of the season at our expense. We're not having that. A to B. Onen. Swaps it over to McQueen, who's in a lot of space here. Brings the ball forward. And he says in, Asante can't get the header off and loft with a potential counter-attack. But it's intercepted. Carrington now whips it in. Asante, again, can't win it. A Corrigan now coming forward to Onen. Can he find McQueen? He can. McQueen, can he get a cross in? Asante straight at the keeper. After all that, he gets it straight at the flaming keeper. And we've got a potential counter-attack on here for Tombridge. We have Wood back to Bear. All the way back to Miles in defence. Puts it over the top. Loft is in space. And Loft has hit the crossbar for Tombridge. Oh, my Lord. Asante heads it on to nobody. And this is just not going very well so far. A to B. Murray back to Corrigan. Bringing the ball forward. Murray goes back to ADB. Bringing the ball forward. Really nice touch there. Murray to right. Back out to Murray. This is better. And Murray put the ball in. He can cut. Oh, and it's Carrington. Gets on the end of that. It's 1-0. That is better. Whew. Getting a little bit worried then. 1-0. Thank you to Carrigan. Really nice play there by ADB. Really nice touch again from Murray. Right also getting involved, which is really nice to see. A 1-2 with Murray is what led to that goal. Really, really like it. Again, another substitution before half-time. I was not expecting this, but hopefully they are just little knocks. And that is very close to Tombridge equalising. Whew, right. Um, I think that's a fair judgment on it. We really should be kicking it up a gear against Tombridge. And with that, with this, I think we remain in top. Asante to Murray. Back to Corrigan. Finds right. Right now, can he turn? He's been tackled. He's gone back to A to B. Back out to right. He whips it in. Corrigan with the header. Oh! Not a corner. But, oh, we do have a corner now. <laughs> so, right will take this. Whips it in. Corrigan with the header and he scores. Ryan Corrigan scores. Car Carrington scored. Now Corrigan has scored. My God, I'm not going to get them two mixed up, am I? I thought that was Corrigan's second goal. It's not. It's his first. <laughs> but 2-0, that's better. Are we going to make it three from this corner? Right. It's headed clear. Murray, is he going to hit it? He does. Oh, and he scores. Kingsley Murray. Take a bow. What a goal. Now we are turning it on. Really nice here. 3-0 after 64 minutes. Really nice effort there by Murray. Proving to be a really nice acquisition on loan from Bristol Rovers. What a goal. That is what I like to see. And we have another chance. Right with a free kick. Oh, and it, did that hit the bar? Oh, we should have got the rebound in as well, surely. Wow, we are really, really taking this. Really taking this by storm now. Right, I've just realised we made a little boo-boo there, haven't we? Right, are we? is it worth swapping these round? Can McQueen play there? He can. Let's just do that. Let's just do that. It looks a little bit silly, I get that. But, you know, just the last ten minutes. We should be fine from here. Maybe score another goal. That would be nice, but... Probably not going to happen, is it? Possibly. We've got a free kick. Right. Whips it in. Sheaf with the header. Sharif. 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 And there we go. 3-0. Nice result. 
I was getting a little bit worried at the um, end of that first half, but thankfully Carrington, Corrigan and Murray goals take us back to the top of the table. Were we top of the table at the start of the video? I the life of me can't remember, but I know we can be caught by Bath, who do have a game in hand. Oh, Bath played, so yes, we um, we were top going into this game, and I'm very happy that we've remained top going in after this game as well. I, I am struggling at the moment, I do apologise. Right, if we have a look at the schedule, uh, we are going to come back, and we are going to play two games in the next video, and we're probably gonna not going to leave it too long. We're hopefully going to get past Swindon in the FA Cup third qualifying round. Maybe, depending on when the first round is, we'll come back and show you that, but if not... If we don't get past that round, we'll probably come back for Chelmsford and Maidstone. Sounds good to me. Hopefully, sounds good to you as well. But thank you very much for tuning into this video. If you did enjoy it, please make sure you drop a like. Please subscribe if you happen to be new. And I will see you again in the next video. Thanks again for watching. Ciao for now. Parker does.